Hello friends, Srinivas here, welcome to our channel. Today we'll discuss what is lookup type and lookup code. And uh, what are the purpose of uh, lookup code in Oracle Fusion? Okay. So if I'm going to my Excel sheet, you can see lookup codes, a lookups, a list of values in the application. So in any of the application when you are uh, selecting any value from uh, in Oracle form, the seeded value is coming from lookup. Okay. For example, uh, customer types, supplier types, and there can be different kind of uh, lookup value versus uh, lookup values displaying in the application. So that is coming from lookup. So now the question is, uh, can we create new lookup values? Yes. You can create your, in addition to the seeded lookup values, you can create your own user defined lookup value. For example, let me go to assets here in asset model. For example, when you are, when I'm going to suppose I want to retire one asset. Okay. Uh, click and retire. A return asset right so now let me find out one asset which I can return okay. this is the asset I want to return and uh, the return I want to return the cost So here I'm navigating to show you like how what how useful is the lookup code here, right? So this is the asset retirement form. So in this form, for example, a retirement region, right? So this retirement region, these are seeded values created by Oracle. One is extraordinary, and one is sales. So retirement region means what are the region you are going to retire the asset either for sale or some other purpose so these two are not enough uh, if you realize that for your business when you are going to retire uh, one asset there should be some other regions available so that i can select okay so to fulfill this purpose you can use the lookup codes okay so now you have to find out what is the lookup type for this retirement region and create new user defined value so that it will be available here in this yellow. So let me go to setup and maintenance and uh, navigate to standard look. Okay. Manage standard lookup. So here I have to find out the lookup type for asset retirement region. So it will be a retirement type. Right? Or you can go directly you can go to asset model and find out the particular lookup type go to financial asset fixed asset right if you go to fixed asset and you will be able to see here the tax for lookup type for the fixed asset find it out okay manage fixed assets lookup lookup type retirement here FA retirement type okay search for this lookup type and uh, if you see 
this is the lookup type and under this lookup type you can see there are two seeded code has been defined extraordinary and sales so which is available in the asset retirement region form right here so now business uh, is not satisfied with this values and uh, they need some more values which is suitable for their business uh, purpose and uh, for example i'll go to this retirement region type and uh, create some more user defined value here for example uh, damage so once the product is or asset is damaged uh, so that that's a retirement region for uh, your business okay so common set i want to take okay and this is damage sir you can see here like lookup code and reference data set you are mentioning here and what is the meaning of uh, this uh, so you can elaborate the meaning of this lookup code and description you can give and tag so this tag it's optional but you can give here which you can use for your integration if you are importing something from a third party tool outside of oracle and uh, it's very useful to uh, tag use this kind of lookup tag in your uh, import process okay and uh, this this is very useful this lookup code will be useful when you are importing something from outside system so i'll go and i'll create another value here that is uh, fully reserved right or you can say theft again common value so it is theft so this is another retirement region okay so now i have created two lookup codes for ascent retirement type click and close click and save and close now we have successfully defined now see here in the asset retirement form just uh, close this form and uh, open it again so now we will able to see the effect here A retire cost so these two user defined values should be available as retirement region so one is damage and one is theft so now we have created two new lookup code which can be used for your retirement region in this way you can define your user defined values for uh, all of your model so select lookup type has been available you can create your own lookup type and values also as per your business requirement so these are the static values which you can use for your user can use like right? you define the list of values as a lookup code consisting of a set of lookup codes okay and end user see this list of translated meaning as available value for an object so this will be available once you define this it will be available in the list of values i hope you understand uh, the business functionality of lookup code thank you guys thank you for watching this video